Hello everybody, it is I, the Willowigi Big Mac, and welcome back to Pac-Man World Repack. Last time... Ugh, ugh, excuse me, wow. Excuse me. Uh, anyway, last time we fought Chrome Keeper, which was, who was surprisingly, surprisingly really fun to fight. I was genuinely happy that, that they actually made Chrome, they actually... Because I'll restate, I'll, I'll restate this again. Uh, Chrome Keeper, the original, uh, born fight, they, uh, boss doesn't look threatening, uh, he looked, he looked like a goofy cartoon character, character, and I think, I think it, you can probably ask a lot of people, uh, who played the original, they'll probably say, yeah, Chrome Keeper is probably the easiest boss in the game, in the original. Yep, and they actually made him challenging in this one. Like, they gave him, like, they gave him, fuck, they gave him, like, rocket launchers, uh, uh, death beams, and, and stuff like that, they, like, and like, it was challenging, but it was also really fun. I was having a good time. Uh, then I went into uh, Ghostly Garden here and died a bunch of times. I'm not joking. I got I got dunked on in there. <laughs> well, I'll do the creepy catacombs. Let's see how many times I'll die this time. Ooh. Okay, they actually made this, they actually made this, uh... Okay, this, this song is sounding pretty good. Oop. Uh, go away, ghost. Ah! Ow. I just, re I just realized this game is stupid when it comes to slopes because you just fuck bounce on them. Let's see. Yep. Uh, I want these ghosts dead. They uh, they pissed me off. Uh, they looked at me. They looked at me funny. I want them dead. I mean, I, I mean, I I know they're already dead, but I want them. I want them to be super dead. Also, strange how uh, Mega Pac-Man can just walk up slopes uh, just like that. Who are you? Uh, I'm just, I'm gonna assume I can... Alright, I, good to know, I cannot kill these guys. So I, just, every time I see these guys, I'm just gonna avoid them. There we go. Ah, help. Alright, ooh, extra life. Totally, because I, I blew through a bunch of my lives in the, uh, in Ghostly Garden. Oh, uh, these bats. These bats! Oh, I can, like, if you guys really want me to complain about one thing about this game, apparently this is the right way. Well, if that's the case, I'm going to go backtrack to that other area. If you want me to complain about one thing about this game, it's, it's these stupid bats. At first I thought they were just carbon copies of the birds from the, uh, pirate level. However, if they don't have a bomb, they swoop down to try and, uh, claw at you, and... Oh. All that for a pee, huh? I may have died, but that worked out in my favor. <laughs> so, uh, joke's on you, game. There right, then. Where is the power pellet? Oh, it's probably up here, ain't it? Yep, there it is. Get back here. There we go. Yeah, but yeah. Uh, yeah, normally I would think the rev roll up here this hill, but no. I'm, I'm starting to wonder if, if butt bouncing is the way to go. Uh, 
Alrighty then. I'm just jumping uh, individually for no reason. Ah! Well, that was a close one. I hate fire. They burn. Ow. In and out, just like that. There we go. Well, let's see how this is going to turn out. Probably horribly. What? Well. Oh. In there, I would have died. I thought I would have died. There we then. Alright, I guess let's just go up here, go down here, do this little circle here, and then uh, start moving back up. Grab you. Oh wow! Oh wow! There's a flame breath there. That's actually a very. That's actually a really mean spawn for that. Not gonna lie. Alright, at least all right, this one. Alright then. Uh, go. Okay, so go spawn right there. Just grab you. Uh, kill that ghost. Dude, I, I think he's stinky. There we go. Funnily enough, I think that was way easier than the first one. Oh. All right, you what? Huh. In most games, that would instantly kill you, so I guess... Good to know that doesn't instantly kill you. It's just a no-brainer. Woo! Thank God! Thank God he can cancel out of uh, rev rolling by jumping. Is, is something going to come back to? Or no? Okay. Well, it didn't matter anyway. Alrighty then. Alright, we got another one of these. And another one. Blech. Man, I love that the fact that the bat right there is just uh Oh okay, see ya. I guess I didn't want you anyway. There we go, I'll take you then. That looks like the correct way, so I'm gonna go this way first. Uh, it makes, it makes me think there's something right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Laugh, laugh, laugh at the fact that he missed me, like a, uh, like a moron. Oh, I think stuff my. Well, that's where the key is. So I need to find a a, uh, a very very special lemon. Perhaps it might be down here. Sure enough. Was down here. Well, first, let me grab you. Uh... Alrighty 
then. I go under you and they. There we go. Hi. Bye. Whoa. That's a that did some funny stuff. Uh, that was the token. And then uh, we go over here and there we go. We grab the key. Uh, uh, zigzag around these around these ghosts because they like to do the the loop. And then I kill you. And then two for one. There we go. Grab, uh... You know, I could, you know, I could try and grab, uh, what do you call it? What? Damage boost. Or, yeah, just, you know, rather than, rather than, uh, go through the effort to turn, turn them off, I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna damage boost. Because why not? Oh hey, a health for me. That that made that made uh, that made my little stun worth it. Let's see. Are you the beach? Yes, you are. Alrighty then. Time to run back and grab that M. Because we did not get to see the factory uh, bonus stage whatsoever. And no, I'm not gonna go back and. Uh, Get all the letters just to show you. Cause I, cause I'll be honest, I don't. I'll be honest, I don't feel like playing the factory levels again. Like, I still don't know how I feel about which one is arguably the worst world. Ah, they all they all they all started breathing fire when uh I landed on their heads. Honestly, I think the big part of it, to this game is trying to is just staying patient. If you stay patient, then uh. And hey, good things happen. Uh, if not, then you kind of die a lot. Hey, we got all the letters. Nice. Speaking of which, we beat the level. There we go. Ugh. Gotta get a good old stretch, uh, stretch there. Alright then. What's this all about? Hmm. This is definitely an interesting uh, challenge here. This, this one looks kind of hard to, uh, 100% here. Hopefully they give you a lot of time to try and grab everything. I know I'm definitely not grabbing everything here. Yeah, I missed, uh... I missed four of them. Still, still... Not that, still ain't, not that bad. 
Uh, let me down my root beer real quick. There we go. Well, let's see how bad this is going to go. Boop. And da 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 da. Boop. Yep. Okay. Close. Close again. But but it needs to be in the row. Oh, too late. Watermelon. And late. And late again. Oh well. Wait, did I die once? Actually, yeah, I think I did. I do not like the sound of that noise. I hate that noise. Get me, get me out of here. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Grave danger. Ooh, okay. They actually made this one. They, they, they made this one sound good. I am impressed. Uh, let's see. I don't know if this is going the right way or not. Okay, good. This this isn't the right way, which which means that uh, yeah, actually yeah, that definitely wasn't the uh, correct way, which is good for me because that means uh, because that means it gives me time to actually explore the area a bit. Oh, you again? Yeah, no, thank you. Wait, can I kill you? Okay, I can kill them. I just have to use the pellets. For, for once, give it the pellets another use, other than those load torches that I, uh, hate. I, I'm, uh, I'm quite the moron. I tried throwing a pellet at a ghost. It did not work. Uh, please yell at me. <laughs> Ow. Uh... There we go. I have I have good tactic with this. Uh, there you are, power pellet. Oh, that was a big boost. What? I want to use this. Oh, boo! I was I was hoping to uh. You know what? I think I actually have to uh, rev roll up here. Never mind. Yeah, okay, yeah, there we go. Here's the trick. There we go. Die. Oh, yeah. I need a peach. Thunder! Oh. What's the point of these guys if I can just uh, hop on, the, on their heads like that? Oh! Wait, can I? Oh! Apparently I can actually uh, hop on these. And that temporarily gets rid of them. I hate I hate how there's still a slight delay when you up. Oh. Ow. Oh shit. Wait, what do you do? Oh, they really did just kind of pit me against two enemies I can't really uh, fight, huh? Unless... Nope. Nope, that's just death already. Huh. Oh shit, how am I supposed to fight these guys? Ow. 
Ow. And also, yeah, because, like, I am... I am between a rock and a hard place right now. As you may see. Oh. Well, I'm a goddamn moron. You can yell at me. I really, I re I really did just kind of start, uh... Going, uh... Dummy mode, huh? I am. Uh, <laughs> okay, that was funny. Well, that well, that's thumbnail material. <laughs> that is certainly thumb thumbnail material right there. <laughs> uh, did I get? I did not get the peach at all already. Then. Oh well. Just. Whew, that was something. Never would I have thought that a a, uh, a, a posing Pac-Man, like, never would I thought I would have gotten a a posing Pac-Man, and yet here I am. Ow! Well, at least it didn't fall off. There we go, full health again. And uh, another one just to be safe. And there we go again. Well, at least the checkpoint was here. Oh look, there's this Pac-Man. I don't know these guys are dropping uh, their, their little bomb. Hmm, it appears they need a metal on them. I wonder where I can find a melon at. Well, that's a Galaxian door. I mean, if I find a Galaxian, I might as well do that. Oop. Okay, well, what's the point of that? What's the point of, like, showing me somewhere that I can jump to? Or jump down to if, you, if you're not gonna let me? Is, uh, go down here. Okay, I see. Well, well, I see. Um, yeah, because it looked because in hindsight, when I was up here, it looked like I can jump to right there. And uh, yeah, my thought process is a bit different than uh, most of you guys. Uh, like it's like well, like you said in the past few, uh, past few episodes, you guys have every single uh, goddamn right to yell at me. I, I completely forgot I was Super Pac-Man and then wanted I should have e ate those ghosts, but whatever. Not a big deal. But man, the past few these past few episodes I really did go uh uh dummy mode, huh? And brought me back over here. Well, I never picked up the Galaxian, so. Nor did I pick up the, uh. the melon, so. back to square one, I guess. I'm trying to figure out where to go. And again, it looked like. it looked like the, I was able to go down there, and, uh. uh, no. Definitely was not the case there. So I think so. If I were to think of like some issues I think I have with the game, uh, music consistency with music is definitely one of them. Like it's like it's not really like a necessary thing. Oh, I guess it brought me back over here, huh? Oh, 
Up, oh, I see a melon. Question is, how do I get down to melon? Good. Apparently, I can't go down. How's one supposed to go down if I can't go down, huh? I see now. I need to. I need to somehow grab the apple. How? How am I going to grab an apple? Again, like I apologize if I'm complaining too much, but these last these last few levels have been uh, pretty rough. Hey, it's like, well, here's well, here's the main issue here. I can't really. Yeah, am I am I gonna get up there? I like that. Yeah, the ref roll's not gonna work. Aha! There we go. I did it. I did it. I'm the best. Uh, well, let's see. Yeah. You know, let's go back to the topic we were talking about earlier. Uh, things that uh, this game could have. Uh, my issues with this game right now. Uh, music is music consistency is a bit whack because. Because like there are times where, there, where like for example, I, I'm this actually sounds pretty good. It doesn't sound compressed or anything. Uh, then other levels, it sounds compressed as hell. It's like why? Like I get why it was compressed in the original. Be I get why it was, it was compressed in the original because uh, you know PS1 probably like hardware limitations that sort of thing. Uh, so the music consistency should. Makes no sense to me. Uh, second thing. Ow. You piss off. I'm talking here. Uh, second thing. I'm not gonna get that. Anyway. Uh, second thing would be... Uh, the, sh the shadow in this game. Like, you can barely notice Pac-Man's legitimate... Like, you can't... You can barely see Pac-Man's shadow, which makes platforming a uh, tad bit harder because... How am I supposed to tell if uh, if I'm going to be landing in the right spot? And thirdly, spots that look like you can land on turns out to be death. Uh, Self-explanatory there. I legitimately thought I could just land down there. Probably, probably because I'm a moron, but still. Like, like if you're... Like, from this perspective, it looks like, hmm, I can probably jump, I can probably drop down there. So, yeah, I think those are my big, three biggest rights for the game. Uh, other than that... I mean, other than that, they definitely fixed a bunch of bugs, which, uh... Actually, forcing you to play the game, which I mean, it's fine. I, I still think that I still think the glitches in the uh, in the original game were pretty hilarious, though. But I can understand why they will take them out. Uh, the flutter jump is, you know, what? it's a nice addition. It's a it's a good uh, uh, it's a good like contingency plan if you uh, if you don't if you, if you impulsively jump without thinking. Wait a minute, this this might actually kill me. <laughs> Uh, like, everything else, I mean, like, physics is alright, I, uh, the way they changed the butt bounce is kind of jarring, especially, especially when you've, like, played all the other games where it's like, oh, like, the butt bounce works the same, and, uh, like, Pac-Man World 1, Pac-Man World 2, the butt bounce is like, you jump, and then you press the A button immediately, and you meet, like, here's the thing. This is me, uh, let me jump and let me mash the A button. In the, in the original and Pac-Man World 2, you can just, as soon as you jump, you can just press A again to do butt bounce immediately. This is me double tapping. 
you can, you'll jump and don't butt bounce, but in the original, you can double tap and do immediate butt bounce. So, there's stuff, you know, there's stuff like that that they change that's... I mean, it's annoying, but, but I get used to it. Anyway, let's save this back, man. You burned a kiss. I knew you could do it, my darling. Now let's do something about that talk, man. Well, that's that. Uh, we didn't we didn't get to do the galaxian, but again, this is, isn't a this is not a 100% run, so I'm not too concerned about it. Same with the letters. <laughs> and after well after we're after we're done gambling here, uh, that'll be the end of the episode, which leaves uh, Talk Man for the last episode, which is fine by me. Nope. But yeah, if I had to give some uh, legit crit criticism, those are probably what, what I'll probably point out. Like, you know, uh, the, sh the shadow is too small and it's hard to tell on some stages if you're going to land on the platform. Uh, some spot, uh, some of the background scenery or foreground looks like you can jump on it. Uh, and the mu and the music consistency. I think those are like my big, th big three biggest gripes. Uh, other than that, uh, other than that, I think I think the game is perfectly fine. Like if we if I were to ignore those three uh, gripes I have, I think the game I think this is I think this is definitely the best way to play the first Pac-Man World because just because of something because like because like especially the boss fights they made the boss fights actually look good they actually made them feel like feel like you're actually like progressing through the fights like i'll say this much as much as i dislike the anubis rex fight because it was like if i like now i don't know about talk man but i think of all the boss fights i think talk not talk man i think anubis rex is the most difficult and that's just and that's just because of all the different phases Second, like, and I don't know what to say would would be the second difficult. Pro probably Kroger Keeper, if I had to guess, because that that one is challenging, fun but challenging. And and the other and the other three, yeah, the other three aren't uh, aren't that bad. I mean, like, Cloud Cloud Free they made really easy compared to the original. Uh, Windbag is is your uh, typical uh, beginner boss, and King Galaxy is it's it's literally it's literally Galaga but with a boss. That's basically about it. Uh, anyway, that's it for today's episode. If you guys enjoy the content I do, please like and subscribe. I'm going to be saying this every episode, so get used to it. Uh, and with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next episode where we're going to be fighting Talk Man, uh, the big final showdown. Uh, but uh, with, that, with that being said, I uh, hope you guys have a good day, afternoon, night, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Until then, bye bye.